Daddy. Oh, it's my uniform. Hi, you all know Red McCormick. Daddy, Ren. Reverend Moore, uh, Principal Clark, Coach Dunbar. Hi, Mrs. Dunbar. Hi, Mrs. Moore. Welcome, Ren. Whoa, poker night, cool. Mind if I play a game? Ariel, all this time we thought you were upstairs in your room. Doing your homework. It's hard to enforce a curfew on the young people of my congregation when I can't even keep to sleep one in my own home. Well, what's the old saying, Reverend? It's always the shoemaker's kid who goes barefoot. Would you look at the time? Yeah, thank you, Reverend. I sure can't clear a room. It's a rare talent, Mr. McCormick. I'll take that as a compliment. Oh, I can assure you, it was not meant that way. Ren, thanks for, you know. Walking you home? Yeah, that too. Well, well this was fun, don't you think, Reverend? I go crazy, and I only up, always end up putting my foot in my mouth. Your mother told me you were good at it, but I had no idea. Good night, Mrs. Moore. Good night. Somebody, 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 somebody's eye. Whoa! I'm gonna punch out somebody, 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 somebody's eye. seeing him again. Ren, why? Just because he hasn't lived in this town his whole life? That's not it. But clearly he has no respect for authority. And everyone in town tells me he's a troublemaker. Who's everyone? The bridge club? Give me a break. Ariel, what am I going to do with you? With me? Daddy, lately all you do is look for the worst in people. And then, of course, you find it. My, my. Where did that come from? From you, Daddy. Today's sermon is, the world is evil and Ariel has to be locked away in a tower. That's a little melodramatic, don't you think? No, I don't. Daddy, you make me feel like a prisoner, and I hate it! I just hate it! Someone's gotta put her foot down. I didn't say anything. I don't enjoy being her jailer. I don't relish telling her no. But then I think, what if I fail her? How can I just let her go? I strive to be a good preacher. And I try not to go overboard. But then I think, if I can't reach her, how can I face my Lord? Heaven help me with my labors. Every day's a struggle still. Someone's got to take the high road. If I don't, who will? I became a man of God his work, to spread his word, to ease some pain and dry some tears. That was the plan. But I might have thought twice if only I knew that I spend all of my time going, ah, 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 no, no, don't do that. See, everyone prays for salvation. And I'm happy to give them the tools. The trouble is, here's my frustration. Nobody wants to have rules. So have it help me with my labors. How can you expect one man to save his family and his neighbors? Have it help me. 